Hello everyone, Oz here from Fantastic Forum, give you another look at my package, and today we're going to look at this Kingdom Come version of Superman. It's a custom statue, let's take a look. So here we go, one box, kind of small, kind of light, open it up and no art box. So this probably saved me a few bucks, but here's what it looked like inside. Okay, so there's not actually that much to the statue. So I'm gonna save myself some time in the editing room and we're gonna do it like this. But it's still kind of high, so I guess I have to stand up. And so like I said, this is a custom Superman statue, which means it's not licensed, so I really can't go into detail on who uh, who made it. But, you know, just go into the Facebook groups and you'll find it. Looks like they made 62. This is number 27 of 62. And this isn't actually the first Kingdom Come Superman that I had ordered. And I want to I want to kind of go over some of that with you guys cuz sometimes people ask me about these custom statues. Ooh, that's in there. And, but as you can see, not a lot to it. It's maybe three, four pieces. And, ooh, he's leaning forward a little bit, but uh, let's see. Let's do the, the old man one. Yep, there you go. <laughs> That's it. Oh, hey, forgot the cape. Okay, and there he is with the with the cape. That's it. That's all there is to this. So let's you know let's see what the other one looks like. Okay, and there's the uh, younger version. Okay, so I was hoping to do all this in one shot, but as I started putting them together, I started seeing a few little things that maybe we need to examine a little bit more closely. Uh, first of all, starting with the base, it's a nice, simple base. I, it kind of looks like it's a um, little bit of that uh, Snyder cut theme design I don't know but it's simple I I like it it's got a little bit of a flair with the logo and all that and then you see right with it where his right foot is there's this weird like paint like something happened there like some blue or other than that the uh the colors look fine paint job looks looks good too it's not a bad looking statue it's a great sculpt and it does look really good but then another issue is this cape this cape has has the two pegs that go into the uh the whatever muscle that is that i don't have and you can see on this one it kind of it sticks out a little bit still but this one isn't actually as bad as the uh the other so even though I was having a little bit of trouble deciding which scope to use the crossed arms or the arms down kind of made the choice for me because it's going to look better on on this one with the uh kingdom come white hair and you know side side bonus to that is even though it doesn't come with a display that it does stand up the uh, crossed arms one does stand up pretty good so I'll be able to I'll be able to just have this guy hanging out somewhere. Maybe I'll put some red fabric or something to kind of make it look like the cape is back there. And uh, yeah, it might be like a little secondary display. Now, an interesting thing about this statue, too, is if you notice, this one's got the gray hair and this one doesn't. And that's actually technically a mistake. Uh, originally, there's two versions of this. There's this one and then there's the one with the black uh, logo instead of the yellow 
the, the one that looks a lot more like the Kingdom Come version. And this was supposed to be kind of a classic, a younger uh, Superman from, you know, that from that, that same style, but just younger. And so they were both actually supposed to have the, the all black hair like this. And then the other one, the Kingdom Come version, would have both, both those skulls would have the gray hair. And I guess there was uh, some confusion at the factory. This is how they how they made them. And there was a vote taken with all the all the buyers, and they people wanted one uh, one of each like this instead of you know getting either one or the other. Maybe they just didn't want to buy both, and they wanted the option to switch them out. I I don't know. I kind of don't mind it. You know, it's it, it's still Superman, and it's still. It looks good so i don't have too much of a problem with that uh one thing i will say about buying custom statues is you don't have to buy them right away you should just find out who's making them what group or whatever and just kind of follow the group i guarantee from the time they're they were up for pre-order to the time they actually start coming out somebody's going to want to sell their pre-order and it might even get you a pretty good deal that's what happened to me i I, I found somebody that wanted to sell this while well, it was still in pre-order and offered a huge discount because they, they just, they needed the money more than they need another statue. And it was such a, it was such a good deal that I actually had to email the commissioner and ask him, Hey, uh, I just want to make sure that this, this person has a pre-order for this statue and is also willing to sell it to me. You know, I, I, I it, it's one of those where it was so good. I thought I was being scammed, but everything was legit. You know, the, the guy said he had, he just had to get rid of it. He I'm not going to go into details for, I'm not going to tell this guy's story that that's his story to tell, but I got a great deal. And now I got a great statue that, uh, going to go upstairs in my display. So I guess this video is going to be a lot shorter than I anticipated, but you know, there's not, there's just not a lot to this statue. It's, it's four pieces. Well, I okay, five, but you know, you, you're going to use one or the other. So, uh, yeah, I guess until next time, don't forget we stream live every Wednesday afternoon, 6 30 Pacific, 9 30 Eastern. We're on Twitch. We're on YouTube. Like, subscribe. We're talking comics. You can join us in the chat on either YouTube or Twitch. We'll get we'll get your comments either way, and uh, let us know what you think. Let me know what you think of this statue. And uh, yeah, if you want to know more about buying custom statues, maybe you can hit me up in the comment section, and uh, I might be able to answer some questions. Maybe I think I can't. Maybe I'll leave it at that. So until the next one, go read some comics.